Moody Gang Team, what it do? It's your boy Moody Star. And as you knew, if you follow my energy, hit the like button, subscribe, and join the Moody Gang Team. This is a channel where I like to highlight current events and I like to talk about my spiritual walk here in this matrix. And of course, I like to take a sip of my water, as y'all know, you feel me? I love this ritual, bro. It's probably one of the best rituals out there. Yeah, so fellas, bro, first of all, we in a brand new month. That means we're in a brand new energy. That means we get to get a brand new bag. Yes. It's time to get a brand new bag. You feel me? It's time It's time to like start a new fast. It's time to start something new, bro. Especially if you ain't hop on see what intention last month, then yo, this is the month to do it. Don't wait. Don't don't be like don't get caught up in just like, oh man. This is this time of the month. It's this time of the year. Shit. I want to improve, but fuck it. I already fucked up the first two days of the month. Fuck that. Even if you go in for the first month, I mean for the first week and you fuck up, don't let that week fuck up the entire fucking month, right? So anyway, consistency is a skill. I'm going to repeat that. Consistency is an actual skill. They don't teach you that, right? If anything... They teach you to be consistent in some, some in, in the bullshit. You feel me? A lot of the times, you know what I'm saying? We as human beings, you know, you being a young man or even if you're a young lady, because this, uh, this is relevant. When we do shit, bro, it's like we're inconsistent with the shit that we know we're supposed to be doing versus we are consistent with, you know, our vices. You feel me? Drinking, smoking, all that other extra shit. Now, I don't judge nobody on their vices because, you feel me, at the end of the day, sometimes life is hard and, like, shit, you gotta, you gotta, like, balance that out. You gotta have your little release, you know? But consistency is a skill, bro. Like, being on scene with attention and shit, that's, that's, that's cool, you feel me? That's, like, a form of consistency. Going to work every day is a form of consistency. I'm talking about, like, you got people who consistently fuck up, you know what I'm saying? So you actually have professional fuck ups out there. And this is a channel where we ain't trying to be no fuck ups, bro. And anything, if anything, we're gonna learn from our fuck ups. You get what I'm saying? But a lot of times when we wanna like, try to like complete a goal and shit like that, we think of like the, the end goal, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay, like damn, this is what I want my shit to look like, but a lot of the people, a, a lot of people who like to start a journey, whether it's I want to lose weight, whether it's I want to stop doing this, whether it's whatever it is, if, I, if you want to go to college, <clears throat> you feel me? We start, we like to start shit, but we can never finish it. You feel me? And if it's like you want to have a skill, any, any fucking skill that you do, when you become a professional at that skill, that means you put in time and consist consistency into that skill. So I'm not trying to hear it, bro. I don't want to hear no excuses. I don't give a damn. <clears throat> damn, shit, fucking dope. I don't give a damn like what you've been going through. Like if you think you have a skill or not, you have a skill, bro. You have a fucking skill. A lot of times people be like, damn, bro, like, you know, you need to go get your engineering uh, degree. You need to do this and you need to do that. A lot of these people who have these degrees and stuff like that, bro, are consistent at what they do. A lot of the YouTubers that are out there, they're consistent with what they do. That's where their channel is so damn successful. With all that being said, I need y'all to consistently be on point. And it's not, it's like, once you make up in your mind and you know what you want type shit, like, I don't understand what's stopping you. Like, you feel me? Laziness, the spirit of laziness, inconsistency, and you wonder why, like, you always in a rut. Let's just start with something small. Fuck the problems. Fuck, like, your issues and shit like that. Fuck your struggles. Take a breath. Think about the rest of them, think about the rest of the year type shit and see like, okay, what can I do every day consistently? It has to be something that you can do consistently that's positive, that's actually gonna uplift your life. 
consistently, you know what I'm saying? It's time that, that like, yo, we have professional, consistent fuck-ups out there. Consistent people who waste their energy. Consistent people who, who, who who's always gossiping. You know what I'm saying? What are we trying to be consistent for? Like, first of all, we gotta know we gotta know what we want. We gotta know where we wanna put that energy. You know what I'm saying? And then after that, put two and two together, bro. Like, yo, this shit gonna pop. It's gonna pop. But you have to stay consistent. Consistency is a skill. So we don't want you to lose that or use that skill for the wrong things. The power is essentially inside you when it comes to like, all right, this is what I want to do. I'm going to do it. But it's not like I said it. I think somebody said it in a video uh, a couple weeks ago um, talking about motivation versus dedication. Motivation is like the act or, you know, the the, the uh, like the pre the pre like hype stage. Like, OK, I'm motivated to do this. I'm motivated. I'm motivated. And people talk about they motivated, but like, are you really motivated? Because if you're really motivated, you're gonna have to you you have to add that consistency in. The the word motivation turns from motivation to fucking dedication. Dead ass serious. You gotta be dead ass serious about what you want. You gotta be dead ass serious. You gotta be committed. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said. If you if you happen to be on semen retention and you and you're just not talented at all, like you don't do shit, like man, you can't hoop, you you don't know how to work out and shit like that. Congratulations. If you consistently put five to six days together, you are on your way to be to having a high skill at being consistent because now it's gonna it's gonna uh seep into other areas of your life. Like shit, even with me, like bro. It's stuff at my job, like I go to my job and it's certain things that like, you know, no one likes to work for nobody else, right? But it's certain things that I do on, on like every single time I go to work. Like if I'm not on point with the things that I know I can control, then I know when I go to work, it's gonna be I, like, it's gonna be hell. You feel me? I'm gonna wanna cuss out one of these motherfuckers. But I consistently, like I'm talking about like, the way how I put my clothes together, the type of uh, cologne that I put on, what I do with my hair. Every time I go to work, before I go to work, bro, I look, I dress like I'm a million dollars. You feel me? I consistently dress like I'm a million dollars. You know what I'm saying? Once you consistently start to do something, you feel me? You're gonna consistently start to attract that shit. Like real shit, you could like, it's it's like a it's 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 like a way where you can kind of um you can kind of like control your your area wherever the fuck you go type shit. You know what I'm saying? I always it it always goes back to can you control what's inside you? And can you do it on a consistent basis? Because once you can do it on a consistent basis, then yeah, you've mastered a skill. That's a skill. People are like you need to get a skill, get a skill. The number the best skill anybody can get in life is is being consistent and 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 also just being dedicated. You got motherfuckers who suck in the music industry, in the rap like I'm talking about music, um artistry, just all kind of shit that there's so many avenues that are out there acting. You got people who suck, bro. I'm like how the fuck you got rappers I, I be thinking like you got rappers like how the fuck does this nigga have a whole following? And his and his music is trash. Y'all ever wonder like how like how they got to be? You know what I'm saying? Like I remember before Kodak Black blew up, like niggas was talking hella shit about him, bro. Like, oh, this nigga sound crazy. He sound trash. His music is trash. He ain't going nowhere, bro. You know what Kodak Black did before he before y'all even knew about him? Because you know I'm from Broward. You know what I'm saying? Like before any before the world knew about Kodak Black. This young dude was consistent. He was consistent with his with, with his CDs. He was going city to city promoting his music. He literally did it like how the niggas did it in the 90s. He didn't just blow up on the internet. Kodak consistently kept on putting in that work. He was the only one to consistently do that, bro. 
because and he was the one who literally put Broward County on the face. Uh, I mean, he put he put Broward County on the map, all because he was consistent with his word. And he and remember now, a lot of people did not like his music, and until this day, you got some people who kind of don't like his music. But it's like Kodak got his own like little swag, own little vibe, you know. And the more he let's be honest, the more he believed in himself, the more his team started to grow. You know what I'm saying? So it's like imagine, imagine just having that 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 type of mentality while still being spiritually cultivated, bro. You're gonna be untouched. Well, you think Takashi Six Nine is untouched? No, you are gonna be untouched. Like real talk. You know what I'm saying? So consistently put it in your mind now. Yo, greatness is mainly about commitment, consistency, dedication. You you get that, you be consistent in, in something good, not not no fuck up shit. Because like I said, we gotta we have enough of those. We're talking about like high value male type shit. You know what I'm saying? We really need to get on the ball when it comes to just really being on our purpose every single day. It's not a Oh, for the month, I'm going to do this. Like, nah, it's like every single day, bro. You got to keep it up. But like I said, I didn't want to make this video too long. I ain't really go into too much details on just what I be doing as far as um, see more attention. If you do got questions and shit, you can uh, either leave them in the comment section or you can just go back to my old videos, bro. You feel me? I ain't going to be on here uh, sounding redundant and repeating the same shit over and over again. I'm gonna take one more sip and then I'm out, bro. Consistency is a skill. And you'll be surprised at how much shit you can do, how much money you can attract, and how much women. Oh, before I go, the number one thing, the only thing that sh I gotta throw this shit in there. The only thing I say don't be consistent at is hitting up these bitches, bro. You have to be inconsistent when it comes to that. You have to you have to keep that bitch wondering like, yo, what the fuck is he? What does he got going on? But that's a different uh, <laughs> video for a different day. I'm gonna definitely catch you guys on the next one. Make sure you hit that like button too, bro. Before you go, please hit the like button. I don't even say please, but for some reason I'm like, I don't know. I wanna I wanna make sure I'm engaged with you know what I'm saying my audience. So hit the like button, subscribe. And I'm going to catch you guys on the next one. Peace.